Hey there everybody, how's it going? This is Bronson from Fretz RV in Satterton, Pennsylvania. I'm very excited to bring you another product from Pleasureway here on their Mercedes platform, the shorter wheelbase. We're looking at the Pleasureway Ascent TS. Now this thing is only about 19 and a half feet, so very easy to get around in. You're really not limited on where you can park anywhere. It fits in your regular parking spot, so take it to the campsite, the store, use it as your daily driver, whichever. So again, on our Mercedes chassis, diesel engine, all the great safety features that come on here, which I'll talk to you about in a bit. But uh, let's take you around the outside, the inside, see if this might be the coach for you. Starting on the passenger side here, you'll see you do have a nice big awning up across the top here that will come out. You've got LED lighting. If you want to hang outside, get some lights on, get some, uh, get some party going, you can do so. Over here on this side as well, you'll find you've got a fresh water tank fill spot over here. You've got some outlets over here if you want to plug anything in on the exterior for hanging out, you can do so. You've got nice tinted windows that run the back side of the coach here. That's good for your overall privacy. Uh, climate control as well. Let's come around the back side here. You'll see you got the back doors. There is a hitch down below. You are set up with a seven-way plug wiring hitch receiver for towing up to 5,000 pounds. There's a backup camera along the back here. The camera system on the Mercedes chassis is great. You've got front rear camera. Gives you almost a 360 degree view for uh, for the cameras. Down below here, you'll find you've got a quick connect for propane. If you want to do a little outside grill, you would also fill up your propane tank back there. We swing these back doors open here for us. Underneath your power rear sofa, you do have a little bit of storage. Um, right now you can see the 30 amp power cord that's there, the air compressor they give you. And above that, there is actually a drop down screen from here. You can roll this down. That will give you some privacy for the back or you can use it as a regular screen on a nice day. Keep the bugs out, let the nice breeze in. You got a little box back here behind there. Actually, you will have your lithium battery store. There's 200 amp hours of lithium batteries total. There's two batteries, 100 amp hours each. And on the roof trickle charging those, you do have uh, 200 watts of solar up there. There's also a generator on board. You will need that if you want to do some boondocking and run your air conditioner. Um, that's the only time you'll need your generator because you do have, also have a 2000 watt inverter that can run pretty much everything besides that air conditioner. So you can run your cooktop, your microwave, get power to your outlets. Along the driver's side over here, you'll find a couple vents. You've got Truma appliances on board, the Truma Vario heat, the Truma instant uh, hot water heater, the Truma AquaGo, very efficient appliances. Your utility center is also located over here. You pop this up real quick, you'll see you do have your 30 amp connection here, your cable in, your city water connection. There's a propane uh, master switch on here as well. You of course have an outside shower if you want to do any rinsing off outside, you can do so. And tucked underneath here is actually your sewage for your gray and black coin tank. And there is a spot on the side over here to store your uh, sewage hose so you don't have to keep it inside the coach. Keep the stinky slinky on the outside. Overall, a very nice, sleek design here on this van. They look really good going down the road. Great headlights, good visibility. The Mercedes chassis has overall the most uh, comforts in any chassis in a B van. Let's get you into the inside here. You also do have a drop down rolling screen over here. Again, that will uh, be able to give you a screen. And there's a magnet built into the side here so that you'd be able to walk in and out when you zip it down so you don't have to keep uh, unzipping each time to, to get into the coach. I'm going to step you up into the inside here for 23. Uh, Pleasure Way hasn't changed a whole lot, but they have changed the interior colors. The flooring design is also different. looks a little more modern. So you've got the flint leatherettes uh, back here on the seating. So that's called flint. And then you've got the, uh, the white upper cabinets here, the white onyx. Um, you also can get a cream colored. It's called cashmere and champagne for the uh, for the tops here. Another great feature. They've also gotten rid of latches that go across these cabinets, so you can see it's a nice sleek finish. All you have to do is push in the cabinet and lift it up, and it opens like so. Let me get you back towards the front here before we fully go inside. I do want you to see you do have the touchscreen display here. Um, all your Pleasure Way models are going to come with this. There's two of them inside the coach. One in the rear. One in the front so you don't have to keep running back and forth but you'll find on your home screen you can do your climate control check power settings some quick lights check your tank levels the generator on board also has automatic generator start so what that means is that you can set the generator if you're boondocking uh you know if the climate control needs to come on it will automatically come on by itself let's say you've got pets inside the uh 
the coach and you want to take off for a little bit well you can leave this set and the generator will come on if it needs to if it knows that the, uh, uh, the air conditioner needs to come on and uh, you can go about your day and, and come back and it'll still be nice and cool in here Corian countertops great finish on these countertops nice size stainless steel sink your sink does have the, uh, the sprayer that removes the head here induction cooktop all your cabinetry when I think of pleasure way first thing I think of is quality cabinets are all designed amazingly plywood latches are fantastic I mean they give you a five-year warranty on the coach you'll find storage underneath here you've got some pull out cabinets here soft close on these so you can try slam it it's gonna close nice and soft by itself you got three that line down here and then overhead again these are all gonna be storage bins that run across the top over here really nice size cabinetry for your storage needs you can see here I have the uh, the table mounted this is a great table because you can kind of twist and turn it as you like however you want to configure it while you're sitting back here on the arms so this is actually removable you can get out the way have an open spot in here or you can have your lagoon table set up however you like this would also make your bed back here so it's a rear power sofa that lays forward i'll be sure to throw up some pictures so that you can see what it looks like in the bed configuration but this is your seating configuration there are seat belts on either side of this so that you can legally bring some other passengers along and again that will make your bed space here nice big windows on the back here you got one on either side this side you'll be able to open up the window here but uh, great visibility if you're hanging out in the back here sitting down you'll be able to take in all the nice views wherever you're staying and also on these windows you've got a big drop down privacy shade that you can pull down there's magnets built into the side over here and then when you want to bring them back up you'll just uh close them away these are almost pretty much like blackout shades to so keep this area nice and private back here I do want to point out that all the lights inside this coach are dimmable. So if you don't want them to a certain brightness, you will be able to uh, to dim those down. If we're hanging out your back section. You do have some outlets, some USB, more USB on either side. So if you want to hang out your table here, maybe get some work done, throw the laptop up here. You can certainly do so. Or if you just want to sit back here for some entertainment, you got a 24 inch LED smart TV back here. The great sound bar for your entertainment above that you can see you do have that secondary touch screen so that you can just hang out back here you don't have to run up to the front and uh be able to control the coach right from there i'm gonna open this again just so that you can see you do have a wine guard antenna that's on board so that will be able to get to your local channels and such coming back to your galley area you do have a microwave here which is put in a great position so you don't have to bend down put things in and out it's right up here easy to access you also have a pull-out pantry be able to store your food and goodies right under there tuck it away lock it up your fridge is also a decent size here we pull out our handle you've got shelving on the door shelving through the middle and even uh, got a freezer on board as well this is a 12 volt refrigerator so this will uh be very efficient running let me get you into the bathroom here you'll find you've got the toilet with the foot flush you also have a sink which is great for the size of the bathroom this is so you can stand in here wash your hands brush your teeth take a shower do everything all in one area and you'll find a mirror here there are led lights in here a curtain that comes across coat hanging spots here also and then you'll see they leave an opening here this exhaust fan if you turn this fan on it will be able to work uh, for your bathroom needs as well coming up to the front here you'll find your mercedes chassis i do want you to see they have the plates that are stored back behind here for when you want to make your bed space that's the spot that you'd put those come back to the mercedes though the nice big touch screen big 10 and a quarter inch display all the safety features you know lane keeping assist blind spot monitoring uh, you've got adaptive cruise control all the goodies that are on this chassis um, heated seats these seats do swivel back to face this way also overall you get the most leg space the most room up here in this chassis so you know if you're looking for a great ride diesel engine fuel efficient long lasting this chassis is certainly the way to go 
But this is the 2023 Pledge Away Ascent here at Fretz RV of Satterton, Pennsylvania. Again, my name is Bronson. If you do have any other questions, feel free to reach out in the comments. I'll do my best to get back to you. Have any questions, give me a call at the dealership, ask for me. Be happy to help you there as well. Uh, be sure to like the video if you enjoyed. Subscribe to keep up with further content. I'm going to have plenty more Class B, Class A, Class C videos coming onto the channel here. Um, travel trailers, fifth wheels, you name it. Uh, it's going to be coming, so subscribe to keep up to date with that. Thank you for watching, everyone. I'll see you in the next one.